learn about ring theory in this video i am going to do a simple example for ring so here is the definition of a ring as you know if you consider a group you have only one operation but here we have two operations like in a vector space so here we have to consider two operations the non empty set r together with two operations is called a ring for all elements of the given set if the following conditions are satisfied we can divide these conditions into three parts as r1 r2 and r3 in the first part we can show that r is an abelian group under first operation in the second part we can show that r is a semi group under second operation then we have to consider distributive laws left distributive law and right distributive law in this example we have to show that real numbers is a ring under ordinary addition and ordinary multiplication under first part we have to show that r is an abelian group for that we have to consider five axioms you know five axioms we have learned in group theory first one is closer property if a and b are elements of r a plus b belongs to r that means r is closed under addition closer property hold means this operation is a binary operation then the second one is associative law if a b and c are elements of r a plus b plus c equals a plus b plus c existence of identity third one there exist an additive identity zero element of real numbers called zero element such that a plus zero equals 0 plus a equals a for all a element of r here 0 is the identity or additive identity sometimes it called as zero element under fourth axiom there exist an element minus a element of real numbers such that a plus minus a equals 0 equals minus a plus a for all a element of real numbers here minus a is the inverse of a under addition or additive inverse then move on to the commutative law a plus b equals b plus a if these five axioms are satisfied we call r is an abelian group under addition then we want to say that r is a semi group under multiplication here we 
have to consider only two conditions clause of property and associative law clause of property under multiplication here a and b belongs to r then r is clause under multiplication that is multiplication is a binary operation on r then associate your law a into b into c equals a into b into c there are two conditions here and also there are two distributive laws we have to consider first one is a into b plus c equals ab plus ac that is left distributive law Now therefore if these conditions satisfy we can say r is a ring under usual addition and multiplication So this is the end of the video if you have not yet subscribed to my channel subscribe to get latest videos This is studies plus Dr. K. Thank you.